Hello, and welcome to Upfront with Santa Barbara Police Department. I'm Chief Barney Malekian, and we're here to start talk about various issues of the day. And today, I want to look at one of the biggest challenges facing the Santa Barbara Police Department, and indeed society as a whole, which is the issue of, of homeless people and how do we balance their rights, the need to get them services, and the need to enforce the law. We're standing here in Alameda Park, which until very recently was the site of a pretty significant encampment during COVID. The challenge for the police department and indeed for the city was to move people out of the park, but to ensure that they had an appropriate place to go. The police department has put in the unenviable position of trying to move people out of the park so the park can be reopened for the use of the public and the children who play here. Uh, against the rights of the homeless people as defined in a recent Supreme Court decision which said that a city cannot move homeless people along unless they have a place for them to go. As I mentioned, that's the challenge that our city council is taking up at this moment. Recently, as you know, there was a significant fire on the west side of Santa Barbara referred to as the Loma Fire. And while it was not started in a homeless encampment, it did point out the hazard that is presented by homeless encampments, particularly in high fire areas and high fire parks. The city council recently made a decision declaring a local emergency uh, with the directive to the police department to close the encampments that are in these high fire areas. The police department recently partnered with Union Pacific Railroad and the Amtrak to clear encampments that had been placed along the railroad right of way. We cleared the area from Castillo up to the east city limits by the cemetery. Uh, and the, the importance of what we were doing was highlighted just a few hours later when a person trespassing on the railroad right of way was struck and injured by a train. One of the biggest challenges for law enforcement in America and Santa Barbara PD in particular is this issue of appearing to be the front line of dealing with the homeless population, helping them to find services, getting them to move out of parks and into more appropriate areas, those kind of things. And I think Santa Barbara has really done some cutting edge things in terms of partnering with uh, private agencies such as SB Act and CityNet, as well as working with city environmental services. And in effect, to remove the police department from being the first point of contact uh, in most cases. The idea is for non-law enforcement people to interact with the people in the parks, persuade them to accept services or to move to another location. And law enforcement is really there to investigate any criminal activity that may have occurred and to provide security for the people who are attempting to help the homeless. I have been in the law enforcement business a very long time. And one of the tragic ironies is that I have been working on homeless issues in various law enforcement agencies for over 40 years. And it appears very often that we have the same discussions. And I think that as we as a society uh, try to figure out what to do uh, for the most vulnerable people who are out here living in parks and in encampments, I think it's important to remember that it's more than just providing a place to live. We have to strengthen the mental health resource capacity that our society provides, and we have to provide drug and re alcohol rehabilitation facilities. And if we don't do that, we're gonna be on this continual merry-go-round for quite some time. But I wanna assure everybody that's watching this that our commitment as a law enforcement agency in Santa Barbara is the preservation of the individual rights both of the homeless and the people who want to use the parks and public facilities. Thank you for listening today.